five tricks to help you supercharge your eye guide. Eye guide is already like the perfect fusion of floor plans and 360 degree images that make getting property information really easy uh, and help prevent you from feeling you know, lost and overwhelmed. But every eye guide has a few extra tricks up its sleeve. I'm gonna show you those right now. Trick number one, add photos to the gallery. And yes, I know it sounds too simple, but sometimes things are easy. And I think you should just take the win. If you put photos in the gallery, you make them easier to get. And people like photos and uh, they want photos. And when they're in the 3D tour, either, you know, either full screen or if they've uh, loaded it up uh, like on its own, um, they would be uh, cut off from the photos if they're on like a listing page or, or uh, another website. So if you put them in the gallery, that won't happen. People get their photos. People are happy. But wait, there's more. There's actually like another trick to adding photos. This is like trick 1.5. Um, if you want, you can add photos to anything in 3D space. They're called tags. And those photos are extremely well suited to showing like finer details. So something you really want to highlight. So in this case, I've highlighted the stove with this really cool photo. And then just to be a show off, I added uh, a link because uh, you can do that with tags to the manufacturer's website. Trick number two, add a video to your Ad Guide 3D tour. If you put a link in um, for, say, YouTube, a video tab will appear, and when you click it, you can watch a video. And uh, fun fact, you can actually have the tour start on a video and then transition into the tour. So it's a really cool way to, um, you know, present the property um, in a very curated way that's really, you know, um, nice looking and then have it transition to the tour, which is much more about like exploration and, and sort of understanding. Trick number three, add agent branding to the tour. So every eye guide can have a drop down banner and that drop down banner can have like a, you know, a headshot and a logo and contact information. And, and you know, that is a really great way to connect someone who's looking at the tour um, you know, with the person sort of representing the property. And you can find this information elsewhere, but uh, it's just much easier and it's much less work for the person um, who wants to reach out if the contact information is right there. So, you know, bonus fun fact about the agent banner, there's a template that you can fill out and it's got, you know, places to add all the information. But if you want to use like a, a fancy custom graphic, you can do that. You can add any image. Uh, with the different aspect ratio if you want, and it'll just automatically responsively resize uh, in the viewer. And they look really cool. I'll, I'll edit one in <laughs> on here if I, uh, if I have time to do it. Trick number four, it's kind of similar, um, you know, along the same lines as connecting, uh, you know, the person representing the property with someone who wants to see it. That is adding a lead capture form to the eye guide. So eye guides, all of them have a special ability and it's called eye guide lead magnet. And you can set up the tour so that it has this form in it. Um, and that form will appear, you know, after a few seconds um, and it can be hidden by the user if they don't want to see it. But if they fill it out, they can get access to a different version of the tour. And you can configure that to be whatever you want. So you can um, show a partial tour and then have the full tour available upon contact, or you can show like, you know, maybe the more marketing-y stuff, kind of a simple tour with like one scan per space. And then when someone reaches out, they can get access to a version of the tour with like a zillion scans, you know, like way, way more. So they're not overwhelmed initially, uh, but then as a sort of an incentive to connect with the person representing the property, they can get a, a more comprehensive tour um, because they, they want to know more. Trick number five is to fancy up your floor plan. So one of the ways to do that is visible on screen right now, uh, and that's by adding furniture. So if you upgrade to a premium eye guide, you, you get furniture added automatically. And you can turn it off if you don't want it, but um, furniture is very helpful. It helps you understand sort of like what the space is for, like its purpose, kind of how big it is, you know, and it gives you a sense of sort of how you would move through the home rather than just having these big empty spaces. So I think it makes the floor plan not only more effective, but just look cooler. The other thing you can do here uh, with every eye guide, um, standard or premium, is you can change the color scheme. So the colors of the rooms, uh, I believe this floor plan is balanced, can be changed to cool, warm, 
and just uh, plain black and white. So you can choose the color that matches your style. There you have it, five tricks for making an eye guide um, awesomer. So that's add photos, add video, add uh, branding, add a uh, lead capture form, and fancy up to floor plans. Um, eye guides are already awesome, but that's five really easy, simple ways uh, to make them even better. Thank you very much uh, for joining me. I hope that's helpful.